up YouTube, welcome back to another video today. So today's video, we're gonna be cleaning the air filter on the 22 CRF 250R and doing a little bit of maintenance on it after a race weekend. Um, so I'm gonna show you some of my tips and we'll get right into it. All right guys, so the first step you're gonna to wanna to do here is find out where your air box is. On the 22s, it's literally the, just the side panel. On like the CR 125, it's the whole seat, it's right underneath there, but we're gonna need an eight millimeter on this bolt and that should take it right off and we'll get right into that. Okay, so after you get that bolt out, the whole side panel should just come off, um, but it doesn't come off straight out. It's gonna slide backwards. So there's two tabs up front. You can see the gap there. It's kind of just gonna pop out like that. And then you can see your air filter in here. So you can set the side panel aside because we're not gonna use that until we put it back together. But then you see this little clip here, push forward on it and slide that out and push this all the way down. And then this is how you take your air filter out. Pop it down, try and be careful with this metal piece and then just slide it out. So as you can see, it's not too dirty because that's mostly oil, but we're gonna clean it anyways because I clean it after every ride. And so now I want you guys to find a nice bucket and I'll show you some other things. So what I like to do before I clean it, this is soapy water, is I like to spray it with soapy water. This is just Dawn dish soap. And then you're gonna wanna take the plastic piece off. So that's pretty easy. It just kinda folds around all these hooks. And then that should come right off. You get all of them. We'll clean that too. Um, but then once you get a ton of soap on here, all you're gonna want to do is the corners here. The more the better. Then you're just gonna want to get it all rubbed in there, nice and good, because that soap's gonna help break up the dirt and make it easier to get out. So then grab a bucket and fill it with water, and then we're just gonna squeeze all the dirt out. So we got our bucket of water here, and you're just gonna put it in. Just try and squeeze all that dirt out. You might have to change the water in the bucket depending on how many, how big your bucket is, because the water's gonna get dirty. And since mine's not that dirty, you kind of just need to go till you can't get any more dirt out, which will be when you squeeze it and can't see any dirty water coming out. Um, because all this is the air filter oil. It's blue and it just kind of stains it. So you can see the water's pretty clean coming out of there. So we're gonna change the water and then uh, do a couple more and get it totally clean. Okay, now that we got it all nice and clean, what I'm gonna do is you wanna go to your air box here and just try and wipe out any dust or dirt inside here because this is gonna be the closest to your air intake and you don't want any of that. So what you can do is buy a air filter cover that will help when you can clean it. So you can put a cover on here and then basically you can put a hose in here and spray out the air box, but I just kind of clean mine up with a towel. So yeah. All right, now to put this back on, you just set it over here. You can see that there's about four hooks on this side. So match that up with your air filter and then just hook them over, over the top. The big one I put right in the middle of that gap there like that. And then we're just gonna do the rest. Okay, so you guys are gonna wanna get some Fab One oil and spray it all over my video kind of cut out. So I already did this, but you just wanna spray the whole air filter. Spray the inside too because you don't want dirt getting in there. And if it does, you want it stuck to that. So now we're gonna install it back on the bike. Okay, so installing it's super easy. If it's if you have a twin air filter, which I do, you just kind of put the bigger side in. So see how it's like bigger. This side's gonna go in first. And some guys like to run the, the gel, like oil around it, but I prefer not to because I think it seals up good enough and I don't like messing with the gel because I think that gets in the motor and gets hot and I don't like messing with that. So. It's all personal preference, but that's how I like to do it. And then to put your side panel back on, you just, I like to line up the back and then you just push it forward into the front panel. 
takes a little work because sometimes these get a little beat up while riding. But just like that. And then you're gonna put your eight millimeter bolt back in, which kind of goes at an angle. So make sure you get started right in the threads. And then you should be good to go for your air filter. Make sure this is all the way tight because it will lock once it hits the end of the thread. It's a nice long fine thread. So there, hit the end, give it a little more tightening and then you're good to go. All right guys, so that is how you clean your air filter on your 2022 Honda CRF250R. And that is also how you clean it for any other bike too, besides the installation and extraction of the air filter. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching and we're gonna do more videos on maintenance.